the basic idea is that there are a bunch of sound generating and processing components like filters, oscillators, and amplifiers that you manipulate to create the sound. So in order to program a traditional synthesizer, you have to understand how those sound generating and processing components work in order to mold the sound in a meaningful way. With the uSynth, you control parameters that are familiar to everyone, regardless of your level of training. The interface of the uSynth is divided into three main sections. There's the sequencer, where you control what notes are being played. There's the synth, where you can control the sound, and the finisher, where you can dial in effects like delay and reverb. Each section has a main control up here where you can set the most important parameters and a detail control down here where you can form the sound to your exact specifications. Check out the range of expression I can get just by moving the dark bright knobs and the fast slow knobs on the 2080 synth. I can start with a subtle version of this melody with the fast and slow set to pretty slow and the dark bright set to pretty dark. If I want to up the energy to build tension, like I might do in a pre-chorus, I can increase the speed for a pluckier version of the same sound. If I want a full forced, high energy version of the sound, I can increase the brightness. This is more like a lead that I would have in a chorus. 